peace and light are very excited. That old guy Australia coming to you from the south coast, New South Wales, where it's blowing its tits off with a southerly gale. Oh, I, <laughs> I can do a big kev. I'm so excited! <laughs> the truth of community have been looking around for ages now for new conspiracies because all of ours have come true. They're all being shown up as factual and we don't look like idiots anymore. How about that? So, have we got a conspiracy theory for you? This I've been waiting to do for over 50 years and it's got here. I had lunch with my great mate Davey Gorrell at Cabago Pub and I said to Dave, when you watch this video, you'll be going, yes, punch the air, I knew it, I knew it. <laughs> so what is it, you ask? What a cracker. The greatest conspiracy theory exposed ever. I love it. The highest rating TV show in America is the Tucker Carlson Show and I don't give a rat's piss what you think of him. The Tucker Carlson Show is the highest rating show in America. So Tucker Carlson, two nights ago, dropped an absolute bombshell that has sent repercussions right around the world. Woo! Unbelievable. During the reign of Donald Trump, he released some of the JFK files, but not enough to make a picture of what happened. And we don't know why he didn't just send it all out there and say, here's the shoebox, have a look. But no, he didn't. So Joe Biden has decided to join the party and he's releasing some of the JFK files. But again, according to Tucker Carlson, there's just not enough to put it all together. There's bits missing. Tucker Carlson got to sit down with a person responsible for selecting the files to be released. And this, according to Tucker Carlson, is the conversation he had with them. Are you ready? Buckle up, buttercup! Woo! <laughs> His first question is, or was, why didn't you just release the entire JFK files? Why don't you say, look, here it is. Everybody involved with this is dead. What's it matter? Here it is. And they said, we couldn't do that. First of all, because the public would lose faith in the American government and it would absolutely send shockwaves around the world. Second reason was that you can't piss off the CIA. As the famous interview with Chuck Schumer said, the, F the CIA's got seven waves from Sunday to deal with people when they peed off. So that led to the big question from Tucker Carlson. Really? So are you saying the CIA was involved in the assassination of JFK? Drum roll! Yes, they said. Not only was the CIA involved in the assassination of JFK, it is documented and I have seen those documents. We are not allowed to release them. Those are the ones we're keeping back. Boom! Bitches! <laughs> So now it's going to be a waiting game to see what happens here. This has sent shockwaves throughout America and the world. Woo! We told you so. The magic bullet theory. Hey? No different than Martin Bryant. Some dopey twat with a gun who couldn't put it up his own nostril and shoot it. Responsible for these great actions of evil. No. Not at all. Not at all. Peace and light, that old guy, Australia. When I get more information, I'll share it with you, I promise. In the meantime, go watch the Tucker Carlson show, get onto his webpage, watch the segment, and make up your own mind. It's a belter. Like, share, subscribe.